Hello, you're looking at a 98 Ford E350. It has 75,000 original miles and it is a shuttle van or a handicap van. It um, was well taken care of, runs well, and the mileage is original. The previous inspection was done only a thousand miles ago, though it was almost a year ago. The body's in good shape. It does have some rust and some spots on the bottom that are, uh, you know, could be addressed or just leave just like it is. It's not a bad looking van. Got a little squeak in the belt. Pop the hood real quick. Looks like it only squeaks when it's idling. Sometimes they do that after they have had a cleanup for a little while. See if I can see what side of the engine here. I know it has a V8 in it. I don't see the sticker. Sometimes it's hard to tell on these vans. I'll put it in the listing uh, if it comes up. Oh wait, there it is. Uh, looks like it's a 4.2 liter. what it sounds like. I'll check that for sure when uh, when I do the listing. Let's see if I see it. That's for the drive belt anyway. I'm not exactly sure of that. Okay. Well, that's under the hood. Now, I, let's look around the back of it. <coughs> One of the rear tires has okay tread. It'll make it home wherever you need to go. But that should be replaced soon. Rest of them look fine. There's some of the spots I talked about. It's mainly surface. I could not get the lift to go up and down. I've had a lot of these vans. It's fairly common to be doing something wrong because it doesn't make a noise or anything. They have lockout uh, switches and things. You're supposed to um, have the emergency brake on and maybe there's an on-off switch before it works. I can't find that, so I'm selling it the way you see it. Not working. Very seldom does something break on one of those to where it won't work at all. Set my camera right here for a minute. This truck is located in Manchester, PA, at a storage lot I have there. If you come to pick it up, we will pick you up at the Harrisburg Airport. If you're coming in from out of town. on one of my trips back and forth because I'm constantly going back and forth from here. I really don't have the room at my lot right now because we have so many vehicles. And this is a bigger one. Okay. Today. Excuse my sniffling. I've had people turn these into campers. I've had them uh, at transportation companies. Use them for relatives. Many, many different uses. 
seems to be in decent shape for the year that it is. No check engine light, gauges are all good. And the transmission shifts fine. Motor's nice and powerful. No smoke or overheat or anything like that. It is a no reserve auction, so don't bid unless you're prepared to be one of the to be the buyer. At the end of the auction, I have to leave a $250 deposit within 24 hours, and the balance is due within seven days. Now you don't have to pick it up within seven days, but the balance is due within seven days. nicely at highway speeds and it'll take you home wherever you need to go. So if you're looking for a cheap transportation van a little handy. You want to do a little fixing on the topical rust spotches and the uh, ticker with that lift. You'll get a great buy here. We have a clear title and like I said we can give you a 60 day temporary license tag take it home with and title it in uh, whichever state you're from. Now I didn't really talk about the back and I'm going to do that while I'm sitting here for a second. The back Seats 10, 10 people. Also has a rear uh, air and heat. The seats fold up or down depending on how it's configured. And there are wheelchair, and t wheelchair tie downs in the back. It's been used, but it's clean and uh, um, certainly can be used just like it is. The vehicle height is 9.4. That's from the road. I'm 6'3 uh, and stand up in here easily without bumping my head or anything. So there you go. Buy this Ford van with the low mileage.